Oh, hello there. Welcome to the video. Hmm? What's it about? Oh, uh, interesting stuff. Yeah, um, stick around. Why? Well, I, I just think you should. Uh, okay, well, what is it about? It's a bit like the American Affordable Care Act in so far as where preventive care is not is not something that you have to pay a deductible for or out of pocket. That prevention, prevention, prevention is about diet, not diabetes. It's it's going to be very, very exciting. But we have to pass the bill so that you can uh, find out what is in it away from the fog of the controversy. So what does it mean to be mealy-mouthed? Well, mealy-mouthed simply means an unwillingness to state facts or opinions simply or directly. Let's uh, take a fictitious example here. Humphrey, is everything all right about the Sally Hall project? Yes, Minister, I understand the building works are proceeding quite no, satisfactorily. No, 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 that's not what I meant. Is something going on? A building is going on, Minister. No, 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 no. I mean, something's up, isn't it? Yes, indeed, Minister. What? Well, the first floor is up, and the second floor no, is almost up. Humphrey, <laughs> I'm talking about the whole basis of the thing. Oh, I, I see. What can you tell me about that? Ah, well, as I understand it, Minister, the basis is an aggregate of gravel and cement on six <laughs> feet of breast builder's Humphrey, rubble. Humphrey, I think you know that I'm talking about the finance. Oh, I see. Our contract with the construction company, you mean. Do I? Yes, well, I understand these stage payments are in accordance with all Humphrey, the usual... Humphrey, what is it that I don't know? What? precisely do you mean, Minister? I don't know. <laughs> That's just it. I don't know. And I don't know because I can't find what questions to ask you. And I don't know what to ask you because I don't know. What is it that I don't know? <laughs> Minister, I don't know what you don't know. <laughs> it could be almost anything. So you can see there, Sir Humphrey, he um, has something he just doesn't want to say to the Minister. The Minister wants to know something he doesn't want to say. So he's giving these mealy mouth answers simply to avoid stating the truth. Okay, so let's move on to our next example here. This is um, Katanji Jackson-Brown. Uh, can you provide a definition for the word woman? Can I provide a definition? Mm -hmm. No. Yeah. I can't. You can't? N not in okay. this context. So I'm not a biologist. The of the word woman. So that's her um, testifying before the Senate for a confirmation hearing. You can see that uh, Marsha Blackburn is asking a question which is designed to trip her up and she's decided that she doesn't want to touch this with a 10-foot pole. It's something that no matter what she says is going to infuriate half of the audience. So if she says in response to what is a woman, she says, well, that's, um, you know, an adult human female, then that's going to infuriate anyone aligned with the uh, trans community. Or if she says a more um, progressive response, whatever that is, then she's going to infuriate uh, people on the right. So she uh, dodged the question. She might have good reasons to dodge the question. It is incredulous to say she doesn't know what a woman, she is a woman, so she must know what, what a woman is. Um, that's one thing that makes it mealy mouth and dishonest. She's a uh, simply not answering the question. E even if she has good reason not to, she's just not answering the question. So that's being mealy mouth. Uh, watch out for it. My name is John Alexander. Thank you very much for watching. I spoke with him on January 6th. I mean, I talk with President Trump all the time. On January 6th, did you speak with him before, during, or after the Capitol was attacked? Uh, I'd have to go. I, 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 I spoke with him that day after, I think after. I don't know if I spoke with him in the morning or not. I, I just don't know. Uh, I'd have to go back and, and I, I mean, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't know uh, that when, when those conversations happened.